everyone, it's Sarah with RegisteredNurseRN.com and in this video we're going to go over how to check a carotid pulse. In my previous video, we went over how to check a radial pulse, and today we're gonna go over checking your carotids. Typically, these are the two commonly used sites when checking a pulse rate on yourself or on a patient. And what we're gonna do is I'm gonna demonstrate how to check it on yourself and then on a person. So let's get started. The very first thing you wanna do is you wanna use your index and your middle finger. Do not use your thumb, because your thumb has a pulse, and whenever you feel on Another person, you would be counting your own, own pulse rate, so use these two fingers. Then you're going to sort of lift your head up and find your windpipe, which is right here. And then there's a muscle right beside of your windpipe. And you can check your carotid on either side, and you're gonna feel in that crevice between that muscle and the windpipe. And apply light pressure, and you should feel a little pulsation. When you are feeling this pulsation, make sure you note two things. The rhythm, is it regular or irregular? And how strong is it? Is it weak, is it faint, is it strong average, or bounding? Very important things you want to know because you'll be charting this as a nurse. Then, if it's regular, you're gonna count, your, you're gonna count the pulsation for 30 seconds while timing yourself on a watch. So count for 30 seconds, whatever number you get, multiply that by two, and you do this if the pulse is regular. If the pulse is irregular, you would count it for one full minute and that's your pulse rate. Now let's demonstrate how to check a pulse rate in a carotid on a person. Okay, when you're checking your carotid pulse, you'll get on whatever side of the patient. Remember, you can feel a carotid pulse on the left or the right side, and I am on his left side, so I'm gonna feel with my left hand and I'm gonna find the windpipe, and usually men have Adam's apples, so it's really easy to find. And then you're gonna find the muscle of the neck, which is about in this region. And then you're gonna feel with your index and your middle finger right in between that crevice area, and you should feel a pulsation. And I'm noting uh, the rhythm, and his rhythm is regular. And then I'm noting the strength, and it's strong. Now, since it's regular, I'm gonna count it for 30 seconds and multiply that by two. So let's count for 30 seconds. Okay, I got 30, so I'm gonna take 30 and multiply that by two. 30 times two is 60, so that is his heart rate. And whenever I document, I'll put 60. It was strong and it was regular. So that is how you check a carotid pulse. Thank you so much for watching this video, and please subscribe to my YouTube channel.